Hey Gypsies, welcome back to my channel. Guess what? It's Timu time. So I'm super excited. I have a pretty good size Timu haul. Um, it's packed. I do have a couple of free items in here that I won playing the farmland game. Um, so I'm be showing those to you guys. And there's also something in here that so many people sent to me letting me know that they had it telling me i need to order it so yes i wanted it anyway honestly i had it in my amazon cart forever and just didn't want to pay the price that amazon wanted for it so i will show you guys that um i have went through and put prices on everything and i will um link everything in the description box unless it is sold out or off the market or whatever. I don't think I have anything in here that would be off the market. Um, but anyway, I just want to say, if you guys like me and my content, please go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Become part of the Gypsy family once and for all. So anyway, let's jump in. I'm going to set this at the floor beside of me. That way I can just reach down and grab goodies. Um, but first, I want to show y'all something that I ordered. Now, this has been something that I've been wanting for a while. Um, I'm not 100% pleased with the way it came although i feel like i can fix it um so it is a straw hat it came in this plastic it came it came in this bag with everything else in this bag let me just say um in this plastic so i already took it out and i tried to kind of work on it a little bit um did i say it was 747 it was 747 and it did come with this on the inside so the inside looks good um but i've i've done a lot of scrunching around here trying to get it kind of you know where it should be honestly i think i just need to look on the website and and look at it while i'm doing it as well um, but here's what it looks like. I love it. It's like a straw hat and I'm thinking I might wear it to the fair when we go this Saturday. We are all going as a, a big family and I'm thinking why not wear my straw hat at the fair? Although it doesn't look like this because I got my, I got my, my, uh, hair clips in. So yeah, it would actually fit on my head if I didn't, but yeah, I can't really put it on for you guys because, I've got these big hair clips in the back. So you get my gist though. Um, so what do y'all think? Should I wear it to the fair? Yay or nay? Um, definitely going to have to work on it a little bit, but I really like the hat. I think it's a good quality straw hat and I've always wanted one. So yes, there's that. Okay. Let's dive in. Um, I did get a couple. Wait, is this one? Okay. I'll show y'all that in a minute. Let me go ahead and do the free gifts that I won. Um, and these are both going to be put back for Christmas gifts. So I just think it's a good idea if you can order or if you can play a game and get free gifts to put it back for Christmas. Why not? Um, so this is a um, lunch box. It's one of those little bento boxes, which I love these anyway. And actually, I just got one the other day. Um, I actually have a couple of these put back. And I think this would be really good for Fifi um for christmas so basically you have your spoon and your fork can you see it up in there see the fork yeah so you have your spoon and your fork um i don't think there's any chopstick or, or chopsticks or anything in here and then you have this top compartment which if you use the top compartment for your spoon and fork you wouldn't be able to really put anything in there but if you put your spoon and fork somewhere else you could use this whole top compartment the whole middle compartment and the whole bottom compartment, which is bigger for your lunches. So I just thought that would be a really cute thing since she does take her lunch to work. I thought she might really like this. Guys, ignore my hair today. I don't know what in this world is going on. Probably trying to put that hat on, but it's a mess and a half. Um, but anyway, free. So you probably should pick them. Like if you're trying to win, you should probably pick the more expensive products. But this was just something I liked, so I went ahead and picked it, not even thinking I was going to win. I don't know. Um, and then this is going to be a Christmas gift. I'm not going to say who's yet, though. Um, so this free item, Farmland, okay? And this is really cool. I've saw people haul these on TikTok, and I'm like, I need one. And they make them bigger than this, too. I can't remember how much this retailed for, but this is Markers. 
And not only are they just like, first of all, look how many is in here. I don't know how many, honestly. I didn't even look. Um, it looks like at least a hundred. I'm going to say at least a hundred markers. And I think it's really cool. Not only the case that they come in is cool, but the markers themselves, they are on one end. So they're double-ended. On one end, they're more of a finer line. And then on the other end, they're more of a wedge. What? So that is an awesome deal, I think. Um, so definitely, this is going to be a Christmas gift. So, And it just zips right up. And anybody that does coloring or drawing or anything like that. Now, earlier, I zipped this bad boy right up. Why is it not zipping up now? Hold on. Hold on. What's going on? There it goes. Okay. And then it's got a carrying handle, too, which is cool. So, I love it. And I did, if you guys watched my nail video from the other day, um, I did my nails, and they only stayed, like, ev one even came off the next day, uh, but I super glued it on, and then the following day, another one came off, and I super glued it on, and it's, and, and so I decided to do them again. So there is what this one looks like. I guess every time I do them, I'll get better, but I don't know. Okay, guys, let me show y'all the item that every single one of you guys, nah, not everyone, but so many people had, had told me that I need this shirt. Um, so basically the shirt was $8.48, which is a fantabulous deal anyway for shirts. Like I said, their t-shirts are mostly under 10 bucks, and I love them. So this is the plus size Back to the Gypsy That I Was, Stevie Nicks very retro looking. I absolutely love it. And like I said, I had this shirt in my Amazon cart forever and I just didn't want to pay $25. So $8.48 all day, every day. Okay. So if you've been looking at this shirt, I love the quality. I love the print on the front. I feel like it's going to wash up super, super good. And of course I had to have that shirt, right? Absolutely. Okay, there's that. And then I did get one more shirt, and I'm going to go ahead and show y'all that. So this one is actually, it said it was a men's shirt, but I had to have it. Um, it was $9.80, and it says, oh, it's actually Fleetwood Mac. It's Fleetwood Mac, and it says, Sister of the Moon. It says, hold on, Intense Silence. She walked into the room, um, Sister of the Moon. Her black robes trailing. So, I had to have it. Because I've been wanting a Fleetwood Mac shirt as well. So, I loved it. Sister of the Moon. And I am a Sister of the Moon. So, you know, there we go. What do y'all think? Which, one's is, is, which one of the two t-shirts is y'all's fave? i like to know. Okay, next. So, I got my hubby a pair of socks, and I love them, and he loves them. I already showed them to him. So, they were $1.79, guys, and what a good deal, because these socks are super nice, um, and this is something I tell him all the time. So, when I saw these socks, I'm like, I have to order these, and not only is that the reason, but he loves space and astronauts and stuff like that, space shuttles and rockets and stuff like that. He's always loved that, but here's the socks, and it says, you are my universe, and obviously, I had to grab these, so it has like a rocket on the front, has a little spaceman, and he is on both sides, so for $1.79, you are my universe, and how totally adorbs are they? Okay. And then I got me another uh, fake tattoo. So I'm going to take this out of the pack so y'all can see it. It was only 89 cents. And I'm debating. This is that last one I put on. And as you can see, it's starting to come off right here. So I really need to scrub that off. That's why, like, I don't, whenever I put them on, sometimes I don't take them off. Like when they start doing this and they start looking cruddy. So, yeah, I definitely need to scrub that off. This one right here is so pretty, guys. I think y'all's going to love it, too. For 89 cents, you cannot beat this. And 
So it is this fox and it has like an Indian headdress on and a butterfly on his nose. And just look at all of the vibrant colors up in this tattoo. I love it. I think it might be a little big. No, I don't know. I don't think it's going to be too big to put right here. So I'll probably take this one off and just put this one right on because I feel like it'll go good with my other one with all the colors and I couldn't resist. So I'm really hoping that it stays put for at least a week because this one... I think this one stayed put for at least five days. Um, and then I forgot when I was in the shower and I was <coughs> scrubbing. And, you know, that happens sometimes. But for 89 cents, you can't beat that. Okay. And then I got me a new hairbrush. Um, yeah, I get a lot of hairbrushes, I feel like. But that last one was for Fifi. But this was $2.37. And I was actually watching a TikTok video. And a girl was doing her hair with one of these brushes sort of like this okay anyway and a girl was doing her hair like with one of these brushes and i don't know if this is the same kind but you can like brush your hair and as it's as it's going down through there you take the blow dryer to it and you can straighten it and it actually will go through you know the air will go through the back of this brush so i thought i would just give it a whirl and honestly it's a really cool brush i like the way it's shaped i really shouldn't probably put it on my head but i love the way it's shaped look at that it's got a really nice curve to it and i think it's going to be a good detangling brush as well so i'm super excited to try that out okay next let me show y'all this this is a necklace and today i got two uh well this one's not team this is a timu this is uh the dupe to the versace necklace with medusa on it look at the sparkly though isn't that cool i love it and then this one is a just a stone a natural stone of some sort can't remember where this one came from but i got two different color golds on and this one i love okay uh this one was just a dollar 88 and it's just a go another gold chain let me just say but it is a alien spaceship you know with everything going on and there are aliens this is an alien spaceship just in recognition of that and to show my support to the aliens so yeah i love this it's gold it's got a sun some clouds and yeah so there's that okay next oh these are for my hubby, and this is for when we go bike riding. Um, these were $2.39, and this is a dupe of the Fox racing gloves that run $30 each. So these are just ba basically biking gloves um, without fingers, you know, the fingerless kind. I'll put one on. Um, and as you can see, like, look at that. Do y'all see that? It's very, it's a very good dupe, honestly. I love it. It does the whole Velcro thing. Um, let me put it on. Yeah, but these are men's, but it would fit me if I wanted it to. But um, I actually have a pair. I actually was going to get me a pink pair, and they went out of stock. And I'm like, well, I'll just hold off. But then I found a pair in my car that are pretty much like this. I like because it has this grip. So when you're riding, you know, your hand's not going to slip if you get sweaty or something. And then I love the fox, the fox thing here. So that's definitely a dupe. So if you ride bikes or whatevs, this is a cool little thing to have. So yeah, we're both going to be having our helmets, our gloves, and all the accessories. And speaking of accessories, okay. So I got a couple of different bags to go on the back of the e-bikes and these are just really nice all of the e-bikes have like the rear racks and you know you can strap um a milk crate or something to those but i would rather have something cool like this and you know you can unzip it and i have already one i think just one of these so far but basically you strap it to your milk or to your 
bar to your um, platform on the back there and then you can keep whatever you need to in here say a toolkit because um, a lot of the e-bikes come with their own little toolkits you can keep the keys to them if you want to which i probably wouldn't you can keep you a water you can keep your phone up in here um you know just whatever just depending on what you're doing but i just love these and this one was nine dollars and 26 cents and then the other one I'm getting ready to show y'all is bigger than that, and it was a half-off deal on one of those games or something. Um, I paid $5.89 for it, and it was actually 10-something, oh, 10 well, 10 dollars uh, So I think I got 70% off, not, not half-off. 70% off, which is, I don't know, maybe, maybe it was half-off. I don't know. But anyway, this one is really big, and it really surprised me on how big this thing was. So, basically, this is another rear rack bag, but this one is almost twice the size of the other one. And the price on this is just really good. Um, I think it would be good to put, like, some newspapers or something up in here and just get the shape back in, you know. So, when you put it on the bike, it's not going to, you know, crinkle down and look ridiculous. But... I love the reflective strips for when you're riding anything that would help with safety, you know, um, the more the merrier for sure. So there is that. Okay. And then I got me a pair of pants and I cannot wait. I saw these and they went out of stock forever. And then finally I got that alert. If you guys know what I'm talking about, that alert that says your out of stock item is back in stock. And I threw it right in my cart. Um, but these were $13.24, and this is one of the items that I would wear on a day when I'm planning on staying home and just being comfy, you know, like the, those um, muumuu dresses and stuff. I love wearing those when I'm not planning on doing anything and just staying home. But these pants, okay, number one, they're like kind of um, genie pants in a way. Number two, they're tie-dyed, okay? So here's what they look like. Hold on. Hold on. Okay, so anyway, here is what they look like. They do have a drawstring in the front, but look at the colors, guys. Aren't these absolutely awesome? Just for kicking back in the house, they're super wide leg. Do you see this? They're like harem pants, and at the bottom, they are like this right here. So basically, they're like the balloon type. They're going to be so flipping comfortable. I just cannot wait just to put these on and just have a day doing nothing you know of course do we ever have those days like doing nothing no we don't um but i love these and i had to have them so i can't wait they're gonna be super duper comfortable i have no doubt about that okay i think one of my lashes is not getting along with the other one right now okay let's see what else i got i got a couple makeup items and i got a couple more jewelry items so first and foremost, I've been looking at these and kind of wondering how they would be. So this is an eyebrow pencil. It was $1.34, which is a really good deal. Um, so I liked it because sometimes you don't have a sharpener, you know? Sometimes you don't have a sharpener handy, and you're trying to do your um, your eyebrows or whatever. So I'm really hoping this color is going to be good for mine. I kind of like that color. Um, let me see if it says what color this is. Basically, it says colored soft cosmetic art, and it just says brown. So, it's brown, but let me show y'all. See this right here? This is that kind of pencil where you just peel this or pull the string, and it takes this stuff off of it so it stays. So, you can keep it sharp, or not really that that's sharp, but you can keep it, you know, keep your product up there so you can do your eyebrows so let, let's check the the color of this and see how it's going to float let me get it going here feels a little bit waxy maybe i feel like it's going to be a good color though mm, it might be a little light honestly i don't know i guess it's according to how much you actually put on oh well, okay, I just broke it. Hold on. I'm going to get it because I got my new thing on. Um, yeah, the tip broke off, so I'm going to have to peel that off. But I'm not going to do it right now. But there's the color. 
and you can layer it up to make it a little bit darker and like for right now i mean i feel like it would be fine honestly but that's what i'm talking about you're going to pull these strings and yeah i was pressing kind of hard uh it's okay though so anyway this is a big old fat pencil and it's pretty long too so i can't wait to give that a whirl and then um, I got a necklace here. This was $3.14. And this will be fun to wear with my boho dresses and stuff like that. This is definitely unique. Um, so it's a wooden necklace, as you can see, the wooden part. And then it goes down into this right here. Check it out. Isn't that fabulous? And then it has a little nether hanging part there. And it looks kind of cool. We'll check that out like it you see that um like what's that color the turquoise look and it, plus it looks a little bit antique-ish does it not it's really pretty so had to have that okay next okay so you guys remember a couple hauls ago three or four hauls ago um 337 I bought one of these belts and it just was not quite tight enough so I'm like I'm just gonna go ahead and get another one and just hook them both together for my dresses that need belts because um, you can make it as tight or as loose as you want to and I'm not about nothing tight especially a belt so it has this right here you know and that kind of hangs in the front so you can kind of uh, hook this to the other one and you're just gonna have this chain and whatever is you know whatever is left over it would just kind of hang down and i think it's going to be really good because the hanging down part is going to be cool because it has this little sun look at that the little sun moon how cute is that so i love these i can't i still haven't worn my uh, my star one yet but it's coming okay this is something i love um this was 549 and i thought it was a necklace and then I went back and looked after I got it because I looked at it already because I wanted to see it because I've been waiting on it. And I just think it's gorgeous. They had nine different colors of these, like natural stones. Um, this, and it's just the pendant. It does not come with the chain. So I have a lot of necklaces I can, I can put this on. But I love this. And here's what it looks like, guys look how beautiful and this is a good size can you see like in my palm so that's a really good size but i just love the white moon now i could have got this is one of the things that i had in my car and it sold out and i waited now i could have got a purple one or a turquoise or any other color pink but i wanted this white one because it really looks like the moon to me and i just thought it was just so pretty so i waited until it was back in stock and I ordered it. So, isn't it gorgeous, though? I love it. So, I'll just have to put it on one of my chains, which is not a problem whatsoever. So, there's that. Okay. Next, we have this. And this was $2.47. And I actually went looking for this because this is one of my um, favorite things as far as makeup goes like a, an eyeliner so it's a kajal eyeliner and i always like to use the kajal ones on my lower lash line um and i usually like black there i am an 80s girl so you know the black liner and everything is what we love so here's what it looks like look at that and then you just pop that off and you can screw it up like this okay so there's a lot of it in there i just love the tips on these i think they work really good and you know they're not too skinny and you don't really want a real skinny one when you're doing your bottom lines at least i don't but there's what it looks like let's see oh yes it's perfect i love it and i kind of knew i would so i was wanting another one my other one is going to be empty soon and i'm like i've got to have a replacement um so it basically just says miss rose i'll hold it up here so y'all can see miss rose and i don't know if it says a kajal but like i said i'm going to link the stuff in the description box so if you're interested you can find it 
Okay, and you guys know my love of self-help books, right? I love them. I love them so much. Um, so I got me this bookmark, and I have a ton of bookmarks. Let me just say, I love bookmarks. I love bookmarks. I don't know. I got a lot of books. I like for every book to have its own awesome bookmark. But when I saw this, I'm like, I need that. Um, it was $1.87. And it is this metal bookmark. You put this in your book and you let the chain hang out with the flower, with the feather. And it says, a well-read woman is a dangerous creature. Don't you just love that? So I knew I had to have it. Um, is it upside down? Yeah, upside down. But here we go. I know you can't really see it, but a well-read woman is a dangerous creature. It does have a crown. And I had to have that because, yes, I love it. And I actually have a self-help book right here that I'm going to stick it in right now. The, the Science of Self-Discipline. I'm just going to put it right on in here. See that? How fabulous is that? And this is a good book, by the way. Thumbs up. Okay. All right. Let's see what else we got here. Let me see. I don't want to wait until I have the very last thing and be like, okay, that's it. Let's see. Here's four. Is that all? Five. Okay, so, okay, that's it. Now, I told you guys that I, if y'all watched my purse video, that is. Uh, I switched my purses the other day. I had a bottle of Advil, and I said I had this little pill container coming from Timu. Um, this is bigger than I thought it was. So, I may look and see if they have any more, but here it is. I thought this was going to be like this big around and like flatter. Like this is a good size. This is a good size thing. Like if you have a big purse, it's not a big deal, but my purse is not that big right now, but I still need my Advil. Um, but look at this. Isn't this gorgeous? Y'all know sun and a moon is going in my cart. I love it. So I love that. So this was $2.98. This is awesome. Um, so you open it up and it has a mirror, a little mirror up in here. And then it has like three sectioned off compartments for your meds. You could also use this for like stud earrings if you like and just use it for a little jewelry box. Or if you have like the real gold earrings, you know, in different color studs, that would be perfect. Um, you, I mean, Definitely, I love that it has a mirror because, you know, um, but there it is. I love this. I really do. It's nice. Oh, my gosh. It's super nice. So, I feel like that was a really good price for that. And then I only have one ring this time, and it was only 89 cents, and it kind of looks like an 89 cent ring, let me just say, but I have a lot of pink shirts and I am one that if I have pink on, I want to wear a pink ring. You know what I'm saying? And I love this. And you can't really tell unless you're right up on it that it's kind of a, a you know, not an expensive ring. Look at the color. Like, isn't it pretty? It's so pretty. It's so bright bubblegum pink. Uh, if you look at it closer, though, you can definitely tell it's not an expensive ring. 89 cents, guys. I'm satisfied with it. Um... I'm satisfied with it completely. Like, the ring itself is good. I feel like the jewel just looks a little cheaper. You know, it's not, it doesn't fit the inside 100%. But just from back here, you wouldn't be able to see that. And you would just see an awesome bubblegum pink ring, right? Isn't it fabulous? I love it. If it's my middle finger, finger, absolutely perfect. So, it looks like I got poo-poo on my hand, but it's not. Y'all know that, right? Okay, guys, so I got one more necklace, and I really love this necklace. It was $1.61, and I haven't opened it yet just to see, you know, what it looks like, but it, it looks really pretty through the through the package here. Oh, my gosh. I love this. So this is not going to be a real long necklace. This is going to be like not really choker, but, you know, probably about down to here. Um, but here's what it looks like. I love the color. It's like a burnt orange or something like that. It'd be a really great fall color necklace. And I just love the whole, the whole vibe is really pretty. Isn't that gorgeous? I love that. That is so pretty. 
So I think it's going to lay good. This heart may give me trouble, but I don't know. I'm hoping that it just lays perfect. So I loved it. And then I got two um, little gel polishes. And honestly, I'd placed this order before I did um, receive the Beatles nail polish. So I already have these ordered. Um, this one right here. Now, somebody was saying the other day that the one that I had on um, might be the, hold on, let me see. Hold on. I think this is it right here. Well, one of them is like a mirror, like a mirror effect. If you shine a light on it, it's going to look, you know, not really mirror. I don't know. I don't really know what it is. This one is the meet across. Okay. Um, meet across UV LED and that's what it looks like. Okay. Let's open it just to see what we got. Oh, it's so beautiful. Oh, isn't it gorgeous? And I think this one is going to be the one I'm thinking of that is reflective maybe or something like that. I can't really remember, but $1.34 for that. And then I got one more that was $1.79. Let's open this one up. This one looks a lot like the ones that I have. Oh my gosh, it's the rainbow gel. Maybe that's what I'm thinking of. So this one, look at the look at the packaging, guys. How beautiful. So let's see what color I picked because I have no clue. Okay, are you ready? Let's look. Ooh, girl. Oh, it looks like a that it's going to go back and forth between like a green and a purple. It reminds me of my new purse in a way. So that is pretty awesome. I love it. I love both of these. I can't wait to use them. Um, I'm going to be doing my nails a lot. I just love it. And the last ones, like they peeled right off. I didn't have to soak them or anything, which is probably not a good thing and probably why they didn't last. But anyway, guys, please let me know what your favorite item was today. And like I said, I will leave my, um, I will leave the, my, let's see, what am I leaving? I'm going to leave the links to everything in the description box and also my discount code, but I think it's only for new users. So if you haven't ordered from Timu, but you've been wanting to, this is your chance. This is your cue to order from Timu. Okay, guys, so that is it. That's everything. Let me know how you liked it. Give me a thumbs up if you like this video. And until next time, bye.